Hey guys, so today I'm going to be showing you my favourite lipsticks at the moment. Majority of these are winter lipsticks because I am in winter, because I live in Australia. So I hope you guys enjoy and stay tuned if you want to know what my favourites are. So I am going to swatch these on my lips so you can see what they actually look like. So I will start from the lighter shade so it doesn't stain my lips. <laughs> for some reason I've stored these in like a vase for this video. So <laughs> oh, it's so weird. Okay, so one of my all-time favourites is the Revlon Lip Butter in Creme Brulee. And this one is amazing and as you can tell... That's as high as it goes. I've used all of it. So I'm going to try to show you what this one looks like on. So this one is a really basic nude. Um, it's nothing too insane. It's just an everyday nude. So, And it's also, um, because it's a lip butter, it's really moisturising, which is fantastic for winter. And I like to pair that one with my Revlon Lip Gloss, which is in, I think this is in Eggnog, and this one is really pretty. And they pretty much just go hand in hand, so I really like wearing those two together. Okay, so next, another one that I've been pretty obsessed with is the OCC Lip Tar in this colour, because they don't have the shade on them. I wish it would focus. It's this kind of purpley colour. It goes on a lot brighter, so I'll show you what this one looks like. And I'm going to be applying it with a lip brush. I'm just using the camera as a mirror, so it won't be pretty precise. And you can put as little or as much as you want of this colour on and create different shades of purple. So that's what this one looks like. It's pretty intense and some people would not go for it, but I really like it. I think it's really pretty. Um, next is a Revlon lip butter again, and this one is in Gumdrop, and this one's really, really pretty. It doesn't even smell like gumdrops. That's disappointing. <laughs> it's also a kind of in-your-face purple, but I think it's so pretty, and I really like it. So if you're into kind of dramatic colours, fluoro colours and the lip butters and the OCC lip tars are going to be your thing definitely. Another lip butter and this one is called Fr oh, Tutti Fruity and it is an orange. I've never really worn an orange before so I'm not sure how it's going to look on me. Camera is being a pain in the butt. Anyway. Probably won't suit my eyes today. That's alright. I quite like that one. I added this to my favourites because I just had a feeling that I would really like it. So this one is 2D Fruity by Revlon. Next this one is called Vibrant Mandarin and it's the Colour Sensational by Maybelline. And this one, I did not like at first, but now I really like it. It's like a coral orange colour. It looks more orange on camera, but it's coral. So if you want a more intense version of that Revlon Lip Butter Tutti Fruity, then go for this um, Colour Sensation Lipstick. It is a sensational. I know, I'm so funny. Okay, so next is a NYX Matte Lipstick by... A NYX... <laughs> This is a NYX matte lipstick and this is called Tea Rose and this is my favourite winter lipstick. It is so pretty. So I'll show you this one. Oh, I'm already, I'm already on my... It is so pretty. I am in love with it. My lips are already getting stained so excuse that. Um, next is a red lipstick and this one is called Cha Cha Cherry and it is by Revlon. And this one is less of an intense red, it's more like a diluted colour, so if you're not really into really vibrant reds, this one's probably the colour for you. You know, it still has that colour, it's just a bit um, faint. So that is Cha Cha Cherry by Revlon. Okay, so last but not least is another Revlon lip butter. Can you tell I like them? But, um... 
This one's in red velvet and it is a really dark, dark red. It's kind of got like a brown um, tinge to it so I really enjoy this one and it is super moisturising as well. So as you can tell it kind of looks a bit brown in the container but when you put it on it's like a vampy red and I think it is so like ugh, amazing like it's if I wear red I'm not gonna go for say um cha cha cherry because I don't know I feel like with my pale skin and my dark hair it doesn't do it justice so if you have kind of the same features as me probably go for the darker one it's so pretty so that is the end of my favourite lipsticks at the moment. I hope you guys enjoyed and stay tuned for my next video. Bye! Ugh, that tastes horrible. Hey guys, so today I'm going to be showing me... Me. Oh. <laughs> my cat's making a weird face. <laughs> but... Staring at it reminds me of like it doesn't remind me of the 70s because I wasn't even born, but like what I think I would wear in the 70s. And this is in the super lustrous, um, kind of the word. But hello, baby. Hello! I love you! So that is the end of my lipsticks. So uh, what's this video called again?